Hey, hi. So recently, I was sketching with my fellow sketcher friends, and I was introduced to this new fountain pen. Well, the pen came out long, long time ago, but I just got into fountain pen last year, so it's something new for me. I was able to test it before buying it, and I loved it the moment I had the pen in my hand. Perhaps I was feeling a little obsessed with fountain pens at the moment, and I had to get it. So. I got it. It's the Sailor Four Day De Mani. It's pink, and the nib is forty degrees bend, and it's made in Japan. There ain't too many colors to choose from, and I like bright colors, so pink was my only option. The body is made of plastic, and the plastic feels very light. A lot of people are saying the body is very long, and here's why. Because inside it holds two ink cartridges, I find this is very thoughtful that it could store an extra ink cartridge. What do you think? The two comes with the pen of both black ink. I also bought an ink converter, which I'll be using bottle ink later on. Now I'm going to set up the pen to give it a test. This is a lot harder than it looks. Okay, I think I got it. This is the Sailor Full Day Di Mani, forty degrees. I think I should have waited to let the ink flow down to the lid first before doing the test, but I didn't. The beauty of this pen is the nib is bent, so you can easily achieve thin lines. And very expressive lines. And it all depending on how you angle the pen. You could also flip the pen and get much thinner lines. This doesn't seem to be working so well, and I probably won't be using it this way. I believe the ink is not waterproof, so yes, it's not waterproof. But it's still pretty cool for ink wash. In the meantime, I won't be using it for watercolor. I was testing it with the cap off the entire time. Now I'm going to test it with the cap on. 
It feels a little heavy and loose. It falls off. Yep, it doesn't stay on so well. Anyway, this is my new fountain pen, and I am very excited to use it in my future drawings. Thanks for watching. See you in my next video. Thank you.